After years of listening to the same rhetoric by members of the society, the gender equality is a western notion that misguided Africans have imported, copied and pasted into the African setting. Feminist organizations have remained unshaken in the bid to uproot patriarchy and fight for women's rights in Uganda. The Forum for Women in Democracy has continued to be at the front line in the fight against violation of women's rights. For what it has continued to be a pace setter in the promotion of gender equality and women's leadership in the country. The organization has strategically positioned itself as a champion of women's rights protection, participation in political decision making, and engaging in issues of macroeconomic governance through the gender responsive budgeting. Patriarchy has a way of doing things, has been deeply entrenched in most African norms and values that trying to separate it from people's mindset is almost impossible. One, however, wonders whether male dominance still counts in the modern setting. Okay. Women should be given an opportunity, more especially in governance, in running sensitive affairs of the world. Patriarchy affects the way of life for women in areas of policy and decision-making processes. The implications of patriarchy are diverse and are equivalent to abuse of women's rights. Female gender, the women in a patriarchal society where the men are the dominant you know, gender, we, the women, are socialized to be in the private sector to be around our reproduction, to bear children, to nurture, and paid, and powerless, and dependent on society and on them, to the extent even of identity. For example, at the time I was grown, my identity was around my father and my brothers. When I was handed to Zedriga, eh, my identity was around Zedriga, Mrs. Zedriga, Mrs. And then I was socialized by my aunties to say, in that marriage, however tough things go, I must make a round basement. You know, we call it a touch or uh, a tisiko. That you make it for carrying a luggage, heavy luggage. You put it, it's round, it's supported. That in marriage, as I enter, they actually gave it to me as a symbol that I should sit there and whatever happens, I must make sure as a woman, I will bear it. You know, so that is patriarchy. However, Rose Matovu, the LC3 woman councillor, Kanyanya Parish, Kawempe said, <laughs> However, the feminist movement has witnessed a rise in the involvement of women in the political sphere with 35% of women MPs in the ninth parliament as well as in the economic sphere. 
women's rights activists say they are working towards the realization of gender equality within the country. We have progressively advocated, even through public interest litigations, to, to scrap off discriminatory laws. The law of divorce that had originally provided that for a man, it was okay if my husband wanted to divorce me, it was okay for him to only have one ground. But for me as a woman, I would need to have three grounds. Infidelity from the man, and then I would need to prove that he was very grossly you know, violent. I experienced physical violence. As a, but that has been scrapped in a case that now we also only just need, need one that is adultery.